Making Chicago Proud, a local organization celebrating and elevating the voices of young black girls. This Wednesday is International Day of the Girl, and Girls Like Me Project is making plans to host a big free day of sisterhood and celebration. Lolita Cleveland joins me now, as well as Lacey, to talk all about Chicago Day of the Girl. Thank you both so much for joining today. It is such a pleasure to have you here with us. Thank, Thank you. you. Good morning. <laughs> all right, so first of all, tell me about this big day, Chicago day of the girl what is it and how did it come to be it is the hottest day in Chicago okay. <laughs> period period um, it started in 2012 as the United Nations International Day of the girl so we have been celebrating for 11 years Chicago day of the girl and we are honoring it um, on this week Wednesday good what do you all do on this day we're gonna have girl time wellness uh, health education yoga Meditation for the wholeness and totality for the girl. Very good. Now, Lacey, yes, a uh, student with uh, the organization. Tell us more about what this organization has done for you girls like me. I, I, you all have been around for some time. Um, talk to me about what this organization means to you and what it's done for you. It means a lot to me because I love the way it exposes young black women into things they wouldn't really experience before. Like African culture, they show like different aspects and things like things we wouldn't like learn in our everyday lives. So I really appreciate it, like being in the organization and learning more about things I would never like learn before. Yeah, I'm seeing some pictures there of you all being exposed to the arts. Obviously, community as well. Talk about being able to, you know, come together with other girls who are like you and have some conversations that you might not otherwise have maybe at school or at home. The community is great. I feel like I'm free and like open to talk about things I can talk to other people about. And like being, having that connection with the girls and not even knowing them, just like for an hour and like talking to them and sitting with them and like having these experiences with them is like the best part of it. That's beautiful. Lolita, why is this so important for young black girls? It's needed. Many of our black girls are not aware. Um, they're faced with a lot, sex trafficking, uh, health disparities. So this gives them an opportunity to learn more, to be free, and they have a positive aspect that they will be great and be the inventors and the change agents that they are destined and purposed to be. Lolita, when you see the girls coming together, um, doing community service projects, um, being introduced to things that they've never seen before, maybe the arts, different cultural experiences, how does it feel for you um, being a part of this organization? How does it feel when you, when you see um, them exposed to these new experiences? I feel great because it's making an impact and it's allowing us, me, an opportunity to impart in young girls and see them move into their greatness and what they're destined to do, which is our theme this year. I am destined. I am destined. That yes. is beautiful. We are so proud of the work that you all have done for the city of Chicago and the work that you will continue to do, especially on Chicago Day of the Girl. We've got the details there on the screen. It is October 11th. You said to, that day is a day of wellness. So does that mean I can ditch work and come hang out with you all? <laughs> Definitely. Come get your yoga on, meditation. We're going to do a little jump rope, too. Oh, okay. Well, maybe on my lunch break, I'll come for the jump rope. Um, for more information, including how to register for Chicago Day of the Girl, over to our website at abc7chicago.com.